Good morning guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to share my healthy morning routine. Normally I put an alarm around 7.15. When I see the time, I snooze for a little bit longer and I try to enjoy my bed a little bit more. Then it's time to wake up and get out. The first thing I do is I drink some water because I'm always so thirsty, I always have a bottle next to my bed. Then I open up the shades to get some light in my room. My room is not completely dark and honestly, I don't really mind because it really helps me waking up with my biological clock. Then I get out of bed and I make the bed. I like to have a clean and tidy environment, fresh for the day. Then we're going to the bathroom and I put a splash of water in my sleepy face. And I use my fresh soy face cleanser to clean my face. I wash the foam off and dry my face. I spray some Omerovixka facial spray to freshen up the skin and really wake up. To moisturize, I'm using the Blue Diamond Cream by Omerovixka. Then it's time to brush my teeth, which is the best feeling in the morning. I would highly recommend using an electric toothbrush because it makes your teeth so much more clean. I brush my hair and I put it back in a knot. Then I put my contacts in one by one. I love working out first thing in the morning, so I put on my workout clothes immediately. I walk downstairs and the first thing I do is drink some extra water. For me, hydration is so important and especially in the morning because I've slept all night. Then I make an iced matcha. Lately, this has been my go-to drink. I put some matcha powder in the bowl and I add some hot water. I use a little whisk and I mix everything together. When you see foam on top, you know the matcha is ready. I grab some ice and I put it in a glass jar. I add some oat milk and I top it with matcha. I make this oatmeal cappuccino and I drink it slowly. Pure matcha actually would be quite heavy on an empty stomach, but with oat milk, it is delicious. I turn my phone on fly modus and I check some messages. Then it's time to go to Pilates. I love to take a class in the morning because it really makes me grounded all day. I have a 10 minute walk and in the meantime, I enjoy being outside and I respond to some of my friends. I get into the class and I love the fact that I'm stretching out my body and I'm working those abs and glutes at the same time. I used to have a lot of shoulder pain and with Pilates it was completely solved. After my class I'm going home to get ready for the day. The first thing I do is start the shower. I hop in there and I wash my hair with shampoo and conditioner. I use an exfoliator and a little Japanese sponge to wash and clean my face. The sponge is very gentle but it really helps clean out the pores. I'm enjoying my shower a little bit and I wash my body, shave my legs, you know the drill. I turn the shower off and I dry myself. Then it's time to start my skincare routine. I start off with a fresh rose deep hydration toner. It contains rose fruit extract and the rose water really suits the skin. It hydrates and clears the skin of leftover impurities. I use my hands to dry my face a little bit and I grab an eye cream from Orveda. Lately I've been using the Orveda skincare products and honestly I fell in love. On top of this I'm using the Orveda moisturizing and I gently massage this into my skin. This luxury cream really helps me to improve dull skin and makes me glow. I use this stick deodorant which is so easy to apply and it lasts all day. For some extra scents I spray some of my Givenchy Le Interdit Parfum, which I love to say. And honestly I think I've never had so many compliments on a perfume before. After each shower I need to put something on my body otherwise my skin is really dry. I use this body oil from Beauty Bio, which I'm obsessed with. First of all, 
The bottle is so beautiful and the oil really soothes and hydrates my skin. The three key ingredients in here are apricot oil, olive oil and jojoba oil. The smell is amazing and it really makes my skin soft and glowy. I apply this on my legs and arms. And actually, the oil is multifunctional because you can use it for dry nails and hair as well. I like to air dry my hair in the morning because blow dryers can really dry out my fragile hair. I do a quick little makeup and I apply some Charlotte Tilbury concealer under my eyes, around my nose and on some little spots. Then I brush and fill in my eyebrows with the Anastasia Beverly Hills pencil. As you guys know, I never leave the house without doing them. Then I take my eyelash curler and curl my lashes for an open and bright look. I apply some L'Oreal mascara. I really love this one because it has a very thin brush so it will give your eyelashes a very natural look. And it's done! Very simple. Then I'm ready to get dressed. This can actually take up to 2 minutes or to 20 minutes depending where I'm going. I can't really make decisions in the morning on what to wear but the struggle is real. I got a simple white redone jeans and fresh summer top from Brandy Melville. Then it's time to get some breakfast. When I walk downstairs the first thing again is a drink a glass of water. This is really something set in my routine and I would highly recommend to try this out as well. Today I was really craving an avocado toast, so I grabbed some avocado, some fresh cilantro, sourdough bread and some extra virgin olive oil, salt, pepper and chili flakes. I'm using one full avocado in a little bowl. I add some salt, pepper, chili flakes and fresh lemon juice and smash everything together. Then I grab two pieces of bread and sprinkle some olive oil on here. This is going to give the toast an amazing flavor and crunch, something I learned from Chef George. Frozen like this, I put it in the toaster. In the meantime, I'm gonna make a coffee. Normally I do two espresso shots in the morning, but because I already had a matcha, I make an Americano, which is one shot of espresso. My toast is ready to be built. I take the smash and I spread it out on the toast. For the topping, I use some fresh cilantro and it's so good. I often have breakfast behind my computer and I start answering emails. Max comes back from the gym and we chat and laugh a bit. We always make a little time in the morning for each other, so we can start the day in a happy mood. I see my flowers also need some love. I often forget to give them water. Oops. In the meantime, I'm answering emails and responding to you guys' comments. It is so much fun to see what you guys are writing and I love all the feedback. I eat my toast quickly and then it's time to get the day started and head out for meetings. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you liked it, give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe and I will see you guys next time.